I heard Grant Anfinger, you led a career high laps tonight, but what more did you need to get the W? Ah, clean restart there. Just uh, got ran over with uh, just kind of truck series chaos there. Uh, you got to restart with 25 to go or whatever, line up on the top. You kind of, uh, you know that can happen, right? Um, I thought I gave him plenty of room for, for whatever may have transpired down there to, to have us enough room and uh, still got ran over and, and killed the left side of our truck and uh, that kind of took our chances away. So, um, yeah, after that, just super loose. Uh, overall, I feel like Jeff unloaded today with a, a really good Grand Canyon Mulch Chevrolet. Um, feel like we weren't where we needed to be to win the race, the first stage. Uh, Jeff wasn't scared to work on it. Um, I do think we were the truck capable of winning uh, after our second pit stop. So from that point on, I felt really good about our truck. Felt like in even conditions on even tires with an even restart. Um, felt really good about our chances. Just, uh, you know, an even restart didn't happen tonight. Uh, part of it, you know, I, I hadn't even seen a restart. Just part of uh, part of the chaos on a, on a, you know, restart with 20 or 25 to go. It feels like you guys are getting closer and closer to that first win together. What? How are you feeling right now? Yeah, from a speed standpoint, um, the last eight races or so, really, since we unloaded at Darlington, we've had uh, speed capable uh, to run up front. And um, I think Jeff has continued to, to push the, the gas pedal down at the shop, uh, make our trucks better and better. I uh, feel like we're bringing stuff to the table and we're getting stuff from the table at uh, McAnally and and our, our partners at Chevrolet. So uh, all that's clicking really good, but our, our chemistry uh, for this nine truck is is clicking and I uh, feel like we're peaking where we need to be. I uh, just really felt like we kind of let loose and, and go for a, go for a checkered flag today um, and feel like we're capable of doing that. Just uh, stars didn't really line up. I don't, I don't know replaying the race. I don't know if I'd made any different decisions. Um, maybe I should have had to rewatch the race, but proud of the execution, proud of our guys on pit road. Uh, thank you to, to Paps and Cody and Granny and everybody, the Ground County Mulch family that allows us to do this. And uh, thank you to Champion for, for sticking behind me. And uh, now we got seven to go in the playoffs here. Grant, you won here four years ago, but it seems like you run well every time we come here. What is it about Richmond, obviously tonight too, but what is it about Richmond that works for you? And what's about this place that you like so much? Hey, good around, Jeff. Um, so it's a place that just kind of fits my natural driving style from growing up running the super late models at Mobile and Pensacola op. Uh, that's how you run a truck around here. So, uh, you got to manage the tires, but you still got to make pace. Um, there's kind of a little bit of an art to that. Um, I enjoy it. It's a, it's a lot of fun out here at Richmond when you got a really good truck. And, uh, we had that tonight. Just, uh, unfortunately we can, couldn't come up with the checker flag. Thank you. Steven Stump of FrontStretch.com here. Come back for more great racing videos. And if you like us, don't forget to hit that subscribe button.